It's one of the deadliest cancers with a survival rate of just 9%. November is Pancreatic Cancer Awareness Month, and those in the fight hope to save more lives, and there is a goal to hit that by the year 2020. Junie Fleshman is with the Pancreatic Cancer Action Network. She joins us live now. Welcome back. Once again, we're talking about one of the most deadliest cancers, even more deadly than breast cancer, isn't that right? That's correct. Pancreatic cancer is the third leading cause of cancer death in the United States mm -hmm. and will kill more people um, than breast cancer this year. PANCAN does a lot to create awareness to help people that are caregivers. Can you give us an idea of what exactly PANCAN does? Absolutely. So PANCAN is really committed to fighting mm -hmm. the world's toughest cancer. We fund research um, to researchers all across the country. We provide services to patients and families to help them find the very best treatment and, and the current um, research mm -hmm. that is happening right now. And then we're helping to raise awareness and visibility and funds all across the country. Awareness is so important. We automatically here pancreatic cancer we know it's it's terrible it's deadly it's one of the worst uh, cancers but not a lot of people know about it and not a lot of people know of the symptoms there are very few symptoms if you do have pancreatic cancer right that's right yeah the symptoms are pretty vague so it's mm -hmm. things like abdominal pain lower back pain um, unexplained weight loss mm -hmm. uh, jaundice is one of the symptoms that sometimes you know the doc will make the doctors mm -hmm. think about pancreatic cancer so the yellowing of the skin and the eyes new onset diabetes but these are all important things for the public to know um, because the sooner sooner that we can diagnose this disease, the better opportunity we have to treat it. Now this month is very important. It is about awareness, not only nationally here, but at a worldwide level. Can you yes. tell us about yes. that? Yes, so November is Pancreatic Cancer mm -hmm. Awareness Month, and there is a coalition called the World Pancreatic Cancer Coalition made up of 60 pancreatic cancer organizations representing 27 countries around the wow. world. And next week on Thursday, November 16th, um, it is World Pancreatic Cancer Day. And so all of these organizations mm -hmm. will be working together to demand better um, and really raise awareness about the risk factors and symptoms of pancreatic cancer. You've been with PanCan quite a while now, haven't you? You. Yes, yes. Have you seen a lot of change in, in the research, in, 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 in patient care? over those years? Yes, I mean, when I got started 17 years ago, yeah. there was really nothing happening in the field. And today there is a growing, vibrant pancreatic cancer research community. There are many clinical trial options for patients that are diagnosed with the disease today. Mm -hmm. I think we have a lot of, we, a lot much better understanding about the disease so that hopefully that will lead to an early detection strategy mm -hmm. and better treatment options. So patients are very thankful and families too. Thank you so much for being here today. Again, for more information about the Pancreatic Cancer Action Network, just head to our website, kcal9.com. Click Scene on TV. Sandy? All right, Juan, thanks.